What's going on everybody? Today, I am about to cause some mayhem. That's right. I am about to cause the Fortescape Escape 2 community to go up in flames. I am giving my opinion about a bunch of Flood Escape 2 YouTubers. My opinions are not easy going. I am not gonna hold back. I'm gonna roast the living crap out of all these YouTubers. Let's go! Also make sure to like and subscribe because this video is gonna be insane. All right, here we go. I got the list on Photoshop. Let's, let's get started. First on the list, we got Enzo. Uh, I apologize if I mispronounce any of these YouTubers' names. I honestly, all of them are, are really hard. Honestly, there some some of them they're, they're just they don't make sense. But Enzo, here we go. Honestly, pretty solid. I think he's one of the founders of Trio. He uh, he makes really cool maps. His content pretty solid from what I've seen. Although he mainly focuses on his game Tria.OS. He makes content on that. He's been doing that for like the past year. I'm looking here, but when he did make Flood Escape 2 videos, they were pretty solid. But I have a little bit of a grudge against him. Let me explain. Now I have no way of proving this, but I'm just gonna say this story anyways. Just hear me out, okay? Hear me out. I got I got a good reason. So back in like I don't know 2017 when I was uploading you know this video, I was getting it was it was exploding, bro. I was getting so popular. Oh my god, I had like a thousand subscribers at the time or something, and I was just playing in a public Floodscape 2 server, right? And Enzo joins my game. I didn't know who Enzo was at the time, of course. But he recognized me, and he was like, yo, bro, I see you on the tours, bro. And I'm like, ooh, let's go. And I, I he asked me my subscriber count, I'm like, oh, yo, bro, I got like a 1,000 or something. And he's like, oh, well, yo, yo, I got like 30K, so. <laughs> and and uh, I, I I hated his guts ever since. <laughs> uh, I don't hate his guts now. It's all it's just a funny funny joke. It's, a, it's all just a funny, uh, funny story in the past. But because of that, I, I would put him in like A, a, he's pretty solid. Not uh, his past videos, he was kind of just recording maps, not very original. But um, so I wouldn't put him in S A. But because of that story, bro, you're going in B. And yo, you're going in B, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It has to be like this. Wait. I'm sorry. It has to be like this. But uh, next on the list is that's right, Lugia seven three one. In the past, this YouTuber was legendary. Had it was uh, they had god status. The Flood Escape Two Warrior series really cool to follow up to follow that storyline but unfortunately I, I think I think she got into a little bit of a drama and she kind of got canceled I think I, I don't know I don't know how to approach this I don't know how to say this but allegations and stuff came out and I just it makes me uncomfortable a little bit it makes me kind of I honestly don't really know what happened with this situation but uh, because of it I'm gonna put her at C okay in the past, she was pretty solid, but uh, in rec recently, uh, I, she hasn't been uploading in drama. And ah, let's move on. Next on the list, we got Boom Richard iOS. This man has been uploading consistently for what years now. His videos still get pretty decent amount of views. This guy's figured it out. He knows how how to run YouTube. He's got it. But uh, a lot of his videos are kind of. You know, a little bit lackluster in originality and uh, effort, I guess. They're usually just recordings of maps and stuff. I have to get him credit. I have to give him credit for having the motivation to keep uploading. He's managed to gain a whopping two 1K subs, which is really impressive. I think I might put this dude, Richard, in probably like C or something. Boom! Whoa! Math Factor 360. One of the biggest, if not the biggest, Flood Escape 2 YouTuber out there. Actually, I think Twisted Pandora is probably higher, but Bruh. hey, you know. Math Factor. Nowadays, doesn't really upload Flood Escape 2 content as frequently, but his popularity was originally amassed from Flood Escape 2. So, of course, we gotta put him on the list. Not a lot of people, not a lot of Flood Escape 2 YouTubers make the type of content Math Factor makes where he's using his actual voice and he's doing gameplay. Most Flood Escape 2 YouTubers just record maps, but uh, eh, they're not outstanding, if I, if I may. They're not totally hook, line, and sinker, if you know what I mean. You kind of can get bored after a, after a little bit. But he has been consistent. He does have solid video ideas and stuff. So I'm going to put him probably a, or no, B, B along with Enzo here. All right, yeah, that's pretty solid. You know what? I'm I'm having some second thoughts about 
my placements here. Bump Lugia down to D. Keep Richard in S. Uh, er, keep Richard in C. Okay, I think that's good. Okay, moving on. River. This dude. Honestly, I don't. Uh, AX River. Axe River. He's got pretty. He's got pretty solid subscriber count. Honestly, I, I uh, haven't really uh, been following this guy's YouTube. I haven't really known who he is that much throughout the years. So I'm looking at his content right now. Seems like he just kind of uploads and features maps and then uh i think he's made some, i think he made like rotate room or something that's pretty cool i guess uh his thumbnail his thumbnails are pretty solid i guess i'll just put him in b as well i don't really know much about him uh, i'm sure he, he's pretty cool but unfortunately i don't know a lot about him so i'm just gonna throw him in b so there you go guys can i get a drum roll please Whoa, who's next who's next hold on hold on Boon Moon. My opinion on Boon Moon is pretty high. I like this guy. He makes he makes really cool animations and stuff. He's got like a freaking Flyscape 2 animated series. Consistently pulls high views. Really solid creator. I think this guy deserves Boon Moon. I think this dude deserves an S. The first S on the list, guys. Boon Moon. Holy crap. Next on the list, we got freaking Gentleberry. 16 let's go so this guy he's all right his content is kind of similar to richard ios over here he just kind of uploads maps here and there although he's been making a lot of videos on jukes towers of hell i'm looking here I got some you know challenge videos funny 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 videos decent c i would say c for gentle berry there we go right there next to my boy Richie Richie all right next on the list we got oh 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 mega here he, here he is guys whoa so this dude he really popularized glitching in floodscape 2 with his uh, series where he beats maps buttonless and he just clips throughout the all the whole map nowadays you gotta know how to clip and wall hop and shit in Flood Escape 2 if you want to be considered pro. Th this guy pretty much adopted that and made that his Flood Escape 2 career. He's a pretty solid speed runner. He's uh, he started in Piggy, I think. Yeah, Piggy speed running, <laughs> and then moved to Flood Escape 2. Pretty, pretty, pretty original. I would say, I mean, at least he's not like the stereotypical Flood Escape 2 YouTuber where he just uploads maps from map test. He's got his own kind of niche in the community. I would say that de probably deserves, mm, I mean, is he at the level of, you know, Enzo and, and, uh, ooh, I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to put him in probably C tier along with these guys. He is pretty solid for his contributions to the glitching side of the community but other than that he's all right his contents meh i mean i'm sure it takes a long time to you know get these freaking buttonless runs but not too outstanding i'm just gonna put you in c whatever moving on next on the list we got uh zura zura uh honestly i don't I don't know anything about this person. They got 18k subs, which is crazy. The only the only time I've heard of this person is like people telling me how annoying they are or how much they don't like them. So I I guess I'll take a look at their content, see what what's up. I don't know. I I don't really have an opinion. This is pretty much the basic stereotypical Flood Escape 2 YouTuber. Um, but. You know, everyone tells me they don't like him because it's like a content farm or something. So, you know, I, I, I'm just going to put them in, in in probably D. All right, see if you can guess who this is. Okay, who's this? All right, leave your guesses in the comments below. Just OG, OG Flood Escape Tours. Come on, we all know who this is. Palm Digna123. One of the classics, although unfortunately, they don't really upload much Flood Escape 2 content nowadays. But back in the day, they would just, every single possible Flood Escape 2 map, they would record and throw it on their channel. They've got like hundreds, if not like a thousand. Obviously their content is not 
at the level of, you know, Enzo, Math Factor, Boon Moon, but for being a GOAT in the community and uploading just hundreds and hundreds of maps for the everyone, I'm gonna put you in C, because, plus I have respect, respect bro, so there you go, C, alright, that's all, that's all the YouTubers I'm gonna add to the list in this video, but if you want me to make a part two, I know there's a lot more Flood Escape 2 YouTubers out there, then comments. Honestly, I had a lot of fun making this video. I think I probably will make a part two, regardless of what people say. What's up guys? I'm, uh, this is editing, bro, editing Fob Doodle here. I'm actually gonna make a little bit of an edit in the, in the list here. I'm going to bump up Mega to B. So there we have it, that's the list. That's the list so far. Goodbye.